Assalamu alaikum sisters, welcome to my channel. I'm Alma and you are watching Culture Free Hijabi. Tonight I will show you my evening and nighttime routine. The first thing that I do when I get home is to take off my hijab, but we will keep it on for the rest of the video for obvious reason. Then I will try to declutter and clean my apartment. I strongly believe that clutter around us makes clutter inside of us, and vice versa. Whenever I feel stressed out, and then clean and declutter, it will cool me so much and bring peace to my day. I'm actually a little bit lazy as a person, so I find cleaning a little bit hard sometimes. I remember when I was younger, my apartment used to be messy all the time. Then I found this 45 minute strategy that is really amazing and it changed my life so much. I also watch YouTube cleaning video why I'm cleaning my apartment. However, there is one big problem about this, most cleaning videos have music in them, which is haram to listen. Plus, I have an extra problem, uh, the music makes very difficult for me to read the Quran, especially to start reading it. I wonder, did you have ever experienced something like this? If you did, let me know in comments. And ta-da, I'm done with cleaning. <laughs> Now it's time to prepare dinner. Tonight I will make a pizza. I'm going to mix my ketchup with spinach and oregano so it becomes a little bit healthier On one side I will put some meat and on the other one I won't because I don't like it actually. This is for my husband. And finally I will add an egg on the top. And it goes in the oven. My husband loved it and so did I. Tonight we have a slightly healthier dessert. This is chia chocolate pudding. It's really good and my husband was obsessed. Then I will go ahead and remove my makeup and start my skin routine. I walked for an hour with my husband actually, but I forgot to record it. Now I will try on this face mask. I really love to take care of my skin. I was too busy because of my college exams and I skipped this for a long time, which can be seen on my skin. I have three more exams left but I decided to leave it for January. My husband and I are planning a holiday in Turkey, or should I say Turkey? So hopefully that will help me to relax and re-energize and be ready for exams in January. I will leave this mask on my face for a while and instead of scrolling my phone, I will try to read a book. I used to read all the time, however, due to my college obligations, I skipped it for a while. Tonight, I decide to not go for a novel, but rather to read this book, which is a collection of hadith. 
We often think that we know a lot about Islam, however, when you take a good book, especially when you take Quran or Hadith, you realize how little you know. I personally believe that major issue with Muslims today is lack of knowledge. Most of the time when you read a really good book, you will find that it was written about thousand years ago. I really believe that we can change this if we try hard enough and make dua to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. We should support younger generations to study and to respect knowledge in general. Practicing Islam is really easy when you have knowledge. It's time to remove my mask and to continue with my skincare. Now I will use this face roller. One big advice for all of you, try to find this on AliExpress, it's really cheap. Can you guess how much did I pay for this? Actually for this and gua sha, it's unbelievable, only one dollar. But it looks really fancy and it's really good quality, so my biggest advice to you is to go and buy this on AliExpress. Don't buy this in regular shops, because you will end up spending at least $30 for these two. And then I will put some retinol, it's also a really inexpensive brand, Bala. I buy this in DM. If you live in Europe, you probably also have this company in your country. Retinol is really good for your skin. It will slow down aging process. But whatever you're doing, don't put this during the day because retinol and sunlight, they are not really good combination. It's really bad for your skin when it comes in a touch with sunlight. I will add coconut oil to my cheeks because I have combinated skin. During the day I'm using many products that are drying my skin. I actually made this lipstick. Uh, if you are interesting, I will explain in my future videos how I made it. It's way better than anything that you can find in shops. And plus it's really inexpensive to make. And finally I will add some Vaseline. I didn't use it before, but many experts advise using it. I heard that Queen Elizabeth used it and that it was one of the reasons why her skin looked so good. Now I will prepare myself some chamomile tea. try to read Quran a little bit. This was all for tonight. I hope that you enjoy this and thank you so much for watching. See you next time. And as always, I have a little reward for the end. La 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 la